Welcome to Firewatch on Late Game Night. This is Tanner from Post Production here to say that there will be no commentary. If you want to hear me and my co-host talk, check for various playlists in the description below. And if you enjoy our content, click subscribe, ring the bell, leave a like, and a comment. We appreciate any support. Feel free to suggest games for us to play on this channel, or over on our main channel called Game Night. Enjoy the episode. Are you there? I, I had a thought. Let's hear it. You heard someone in the bushes. Yeah. Okay, so let's assume we're being tailed. Or you are, at least. Where are you right now? Just on my way back, in and out of trees in the middle of nowhere. Do you see anybody? No, definitely not. All right, so uh, tell me what you think of this. <laughs> Did you just cough? No. Did you just cough? No. Oh, oh fuck. fuck. Um, there isn't any way someone, like, another lookout could be on this line, is there? No. Not without tapping our radios. Well, what about when I heard you talking to someone else? I just left your line open. That's not what this is. Get in your tower. Shut the door. Don't leave, and don't use your radio. I'll call you. Understand? I will call you. Thoroughfare Tower, this is Two Forks calling you for the, oh, 50th time today. The flapjack fire continues to move in a southerly fashion. Delilah, for fuck's sake, answer your radio. Hello, sunshine. Sorry, went out for a little bit. What can I do you for? I didn't sleep a wink last night, and I've been going crazy for the past six hours of sunup. How are you so chipper? Well, it's a new day. What a day, this day we've been given. Maybe I am actually asleep right now. Maybe I didn't stay up all night knowing that someone is... I actually slept just great. Uh, okay. By the way, I was wondering if your flora of the Shoshone info poster was still up inside your tower? What? It's just protocol that those stay up. You know, info about your tower, the surrounding tree species, etc. Uh, uh, all right. Just, you know... Have a look at it. Make sure it's in ship shape. Okay, yeah, it's up. Why are you acting like this? Great. Just wonderful. Do you see the tree in the top row, second from the left? Sure. It's the, uh... No. You don't need to tell me. Just, um, internalize it. It's a great tree. And there's an area called, um, that tree's name in your sector that... Maybe you should take a midday hike to. Maybe. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Um, maybe I should go for a hike. Nothing like an afternoon in the Rockies, I tell ya. Radio me the moment you get there.
Uh, I'm here at Cottonwood Creek. You see the cash box there? Uh, it must be around here somewhere. It is. Find it and open it. I changed the code. It's 5678. Are you kidding me? I was in a rush. Uh, okay, found the cash box. Great, open it. I've got it now. Good. I spent all day getting you that radio. <laughs> I hiked to a cash box, lied to a ranger, lied to another ranger, and hopefully you are now holding a clean, untapped radio. Hopefully. Holy fuck, Henry. We have to get into that site. What the fuck is going on? People are listening to us? I don't know. Our radios are tapped? Are you fucking serious? are definitely tapped. That's why I left you the one you just got. How, how, how is this even possible? I don't know, Henry. What do you know? I know that I'm scared. Are there any other lookouts this is happening to? Someone else in on this? Anyone? <sighs> this is just happening to us. Everyone else is fine. Are you sure? Yes. I've tried to bring it up to Chimney Rock, Elk's Fork, and Beartooth Lookout, and every one of them got confused. Asked me if I'm okay and if I need to be relieved. Our fucking state coordinator asked if I was just having lady troubles. So no, this isn't happening to anyone else, and I'm done asking. None of it makes any sense. Look, I'm headed back to the gate, and now that I've got an axe, we'll know something soon. You need to get into that site. Call me when you find something. Hey. Uh, I just thought of something not, um, not great. What is it? I filed a report that said that neither of us ever talked to or saw those girls, the ones that went missing a few weeks back. What? Why would you do that? I told you to say the minimum and just keep it vague. I know. And I didn't. I, I, I just didn't want to be hassled. And now someone probably has a transcript of that entire conversation. I've filed a report that's a blatant lie. Oh, and those girls are still missing. Yep. Fuck, Delilah. Fuck, indeed. We really need to get to the bottom of this. Uh, I just heard something. What is it? 
I, I don't know. It was goddamn terrifying, though. Well, it could be an elk, or it could be someone trying to get you to radio about a loud noise so they know where you are. You don't do that again. I'm busting the gate down. There's nobody around, and it's the quickest way in. Copy that. <clears throat> I smashed open the gate. Should I try to fix or hide this? No, screw it. Okay, then. Stung by a bee. Okay. Is is that it? Yeah. Did it did it hurt? Yes, kind of. O okay, I'm I'm sorry. Sight. I don't see anybody around. Lucky for us. Yeah, lucky for us. D, there is some serious comms equipment out here, wireless stuff. What do you mean? I'm talking a big 20-foot tall transmission tower. And they can probably listen to whoever the hell they want. They're nestled down in this valley, which makes it impossible for you or any lookout to see them. something with the soil out here too it's all gridded off uh, who knows what else they're up to and there are all sorts of contraptions and shit out here like what dishes and stuff on metal legs there are wires all over the place i don't know i'm not really up on high tech What's it like? 
It's definitely some sort of monitoring station. I just I wonder where they are. All, all of their stuff is here. And they know you're there, so see what you can find and get out. This place sleeps three. They've got a row of cots here. So they live and work in the same tent? Yeah, it's all one operation. Huh, like us? Yeah, like us. I found their main monitoring desk. Oh my god, what do you see? Seriously, at this stage, I'd believe just about anything. There's a box here with a dial. It has a needle, like it measures earthquakes. You mean like a lie detector? Yeah, I'm not sticking around to get hooked up to it. There's some sort of monitor. I don't know what it does. Maybe air quality or something? Maybe they're keeping data on everything that could impact our moods. That looks possible. This is crazy. I mean, this stuff looks like it just got lifted out of the space shuttle. I have to tell you, if I found out this was NASA, I'd be a hell of a lot happier. Well, they're measuring the barometric pressure, too. Why? Maybe it's just a diversion. Okay. Shit. Got another clipboard here that confirms that they're tracking our movements. The log they've got tracks the movement of four subjects. You and me? Uh, yeah. De definitely me. And I suppose you too. What about the other two? Maybe the Goodwins? What if they were following them last summer? God, Henry, I don't know. If they were, there's no way Brian knew. He would have said something. Yeah, I can't imagine a kid like that could have kept this under his hat. We'll talk this over and figure out how to get the hell out of here. They've got a map with all sorts of paths and areas marked out on it. There are lines that look like some of the paths I normally take. Are you positive it's you? Uh, some of their descriptions seem like uncharitable ways of describing me, yeah. desk in here is a mess. I mean, it's, it's like someone was in a rush or knocked a bunch of stuff over on accident. Okay, this thing is losing its mind, beeping like crazy. I can hear it. What, what's it after? I don't know. I'm gonna go find out. What is it? 
There's a folder of reports here. What do they say? They're assessments about the two of us. There's stuff in here about Julia. Like what? Stuff I didn't tell you. This is... What, what does it say about me? You said there was one about me. And it looks like they've been following me around. What I do when I'm out hiking? Jesus! Henry, do you hear me? You have a boyfriend, Javier? What the fuck? Wish you hadn't left that out? I don't! I, I didn't! This is insane! I'm so sick of letting these people do this to us. We should just burn the place down! Think about it. Delilah. What? Think about it. I am, and I think it's insane. They'd be fucked. Yeah, and how about if that fire comes up the mountain, or someone were to die in it? We call it in? We call it in? Yeah, maybe. My god, Delilah, no. No way. Well, maybe it's not the best idea. Yeah, it's definitely not the best idea. Ah, so fucking wound up! It's alright, I'm just gonna hike back. We have the wave receiver and tomorrow we can figure out what to do. There's smoke coming from the site. I just climbed out of there and the bridge collapsed. What the hell happened to you? It's definitely not the best idea. It wasn't me. <sighs> what do we do? We ignore it, obviously. If they come to put water on it, then we know the Forest Service is connected somehow. The person who did it is still out there right now, Henry. We're talking about people watching us out here who are now burning the forest and everything in it around us. I, I, I don't know what to do about that. Except get the hell out. Yes, get us the hell out of here. I will.